Ready, set, go. Have you ever done a piece of content where you had said, okay, yeah, this is going to make really big difference for my people. Yeah. And then you ship it, go through the rest of your day, wake up the next day, experience the content again and say, what? What do you say? That kind of sucked a little bit. And you know what? The information in that video, good information. Nevertheless, I thought I should remix it. So here you go. What is a freelancer? Dreamers and happy Wednesday. It's Michael from Bizarre Design Lab. Today, freelancers. What is a freelancer and is there a difference between a freelancer and an entrepreneur? Yes, there is a difference. We're just going to start there and then and then I'll kind of give you some examples of what a freelancer is. A freelancer you could think of as somebody who is contracted, hired to do some work, uh, usually by an organization. Uh, in some cases, an individual would, would hire you as well. I'm a graphic designer, so I get hired by individuals all the time. I also get hired by organizations to do like brand identity work. So that's, uh, that's kind of an idea, the idea behind a, a freelancer is you're out here on your own. You're not working for somebody else as a W-2 employee. You are your business. You're providing some work for somebody else in exchange for money. And you, you do the work you get paid to do the work. Then you do some more work and you build up a client base, you have plenty of clients, and you are the business ultimately, and you're the face of the business. Now an entrepreneur is uh, somebody who is building a business that is bigger than themselves. So you're managing multiple projects at once and you have employees to help you. So you could run a design firm, for instance, and have designers working for you. You have a business that is much bigger than you can handle on your own. And that's what uh, that's kind of what the entrepreneur is all about. You might be surprised at, at the different industries that freelancers are part of. Of course, I'm a graphic designer. I love the idea that I can kind of form my business into where my strengths are. That's why I love the freelance space. Hey, maybe you're somebody who just entered into the freelance lifestyle from a nine to five. Maybe you've been a freelancer for a while now and you're just trying to navigate the terrain. Maybe you're a freelance professional looking to scale up and become an entrepreneur or a solopreneur someday. If you're any of those three people, I welcome you. You're the person that I make these videos for. Also, I have the super secret daydreamers club. I'd like to invite you to, but first you have to recite the dreamers oath. So I'd ask you to raise your right hand and repeat after me. I will identify and pursue the work I love while building the skills I need to solve the problems that matter most to my people and only my people. Okay, that should just about do it. Now click the link in the description that says Super Secret Daydreamers Club and I'll take it from there. Of course, if you like this video, click the like button below. It's a good way to say, hey Mike, I don't just think I like. I know. Click the subscribe button if you want YouTube to put more videos of mine on your feed. Hey, until next time, toodles. Hey Tinker. Yes? Do you mind if we give a shout out real quick? Go ahead. Great. Okay. First one goes to Tony at AZ Business Solutions for helping me put food on my table as well as helping me shoot this video. And the second one going out to Johnny V Smoke Shack in Perry, Michigan. You've got to try the brisket. Michael. I'm just a robot. Suit yourself.